Over here, over here, over here. Let's go. Let's go. Guys. Who is this? He's the guy. Huh? Okay. You ready? You ready? I get to be the dummy man. I'm used to being that around the house at home. Alright guys, we're going to work some leg riding. Leg riding techniques. Anybody in here, you guys like to uh, go legs in, go boots in? Yeah? Some of you guys do? Okay, well, hopefully we can turn uh, the rest of you guys by the end of today. Uh, the first thing we're going to work on is we're going to work on getting our, our leg in, okay? Right? Yeah. A lot of people think it's hard, but I mean, once you get it down, it's actually really easy. Right? Uh, one of the techniques that I use is I just like to bump forward and keep my hips in, uh, locking arm out, and it makes it really easy to, to throw that boot in. Now I'm going to go here, your, your regular start, boom, I'm going to bump him forward, all right? Turn here. Okay? As I bump him forward, keeping my hips in, this knee's behind the butt, this knee's in front of the thigh, and I pitch, all right? Okay? Bump him forward, you see where my legs are? Right here, all right? Okay, this keeps him forward really well right here. Right now, I'm putting a lot of pressure forward on his hand. Okay, one of the main reasons that that we can't get our legs in is because he's catching me with these hands a lot of times. I try to throw this in, he catches them. Right? Even if I do get it in and his hands are free, he's throwing that thing out. All right? We got to get rid of those hands. We're gonna put all the pressure down on his hands, make him make him really heavy. Okay? We make it really heavy here, right here. All right? You see that? Okay? There's no way he's gonna be able to move his hands. Okay? Move those things forward. In goes my leg. Right there. Alright? Do you guys see the position I'm in right now? Okay? My bottom, my, my hips aren't turned down, right? I don't have this leg deep in like this. Alright, I'm trying to hook. I'm trying to hook. When I get my legs in, I'm almost in a runner's stance. You guys, you guys see track meets, you know? The runners, when they start, they're like right here. Okay? That's where I'm at. I bump the floor, I put the weight on the hands. As soon as I, I, I'm, I'm pinching, I've got one knee in front, one knee in back, I throw this leg in, and I'm right here. Right? Okay, I still got pressure with this knee in the butt. Alright? I'm just hooking the heel here, and my toe is still on the mat. Okay? From here, I can drive his hips to hit the hips down really well. If I'm over here, I can't, and he can sit me really, really easy. Alright? I'm gonna bump him forward. Alright? I'm, I'm parallel with him. Alright? Here, I'm gonna throw that leg in and I'm gonna stay parallel. Boom. Right there. Okay? I'm almost touching this heel to this knee. Okay? Right here. Yeah. Really easy to drive it down from here. Okay? I'm just gonna come back, grab this opposite ankle, drive it forward. Right there. I got this deep, okay? And I'm not on my hip, right? So for you leg riders that already do leg riding, that's something that we need to change. We need to change the thought that when I throw my leg in, I have to get it way deep down in here, okay? I can have a shallow leg, it has to be 10 times more effective than that, all right? So that's what we're gonna do. Get with your partner, you're gonna bump him forward, put all the weight on his hands. All the weight on his hands. I'm gonna pinch, with my knees, one in front, one in back, all right? Once I know I'm blocked out and I got lots of weight on the hands, I'm gonna throw a leg in, go to the runner start, right there, okay? I can keep pressure here, and I, I mean, I'm not even on top of this guy, but I'm keeping a ton of pressure on him, all right? As soon as I get to here, look, look, too much pressure for him, all right? From here, I'm gonna drive him down. Boom, and then hook. All right, let's do that. You guys got it? Ready? Go!